Hi guys, this is Rinkesh Patel and uh, welcome to my channel of design tutorial and uh, in this tutorial we will learn how to use cylinder and sphere only two options okay so for that I already created a smaller geometry and we are going to select sphere simple sphere has two options center point and diameter and arc okay first we are gonna use center point and diameter here in the center point there are several options uh, like this is inferred point so you can select any point in the window okay this is cursor location so you can just put uh, everywhere this spheres center another existing point only a real point or existing point you can select there end point this is control point this is intersection point this is uh, arc or ellipse so these all points you already learning before video or previous videos okay another option dimensions dimensions uh, there are diameter you know that sphere have only one dimension that is diameter okay i don't know about second one <laughs> Okay, okay. There are option none, unite, subtract, intersect. They're already you used in extrude. Setting, associate, center point. This is the different. Okay, I will show you. Now we are going to select center point. This is the same. Uh, so you can select. Uh, I prefer use in front point for most of use. Or so simple use you can select this point you can select the middle point of this you can select the center of the uh, center point of this curve you can select the center point of this horizontal line or you can select this point or you can select this point or you can select every point okay guys I am selecting this point and diameter of 150 and uh, done okay so you can see that the 150 mm diameter sphere is already created you got it now I'm deleting this using sphere selecting this point also here selecting associate center point and okay now what will happen if I will change in the sketch of this suppose 430 and I am using 400 sorry i am i am just dragging this down and finishing the sketch so the sphere will be remaining on that point only that point okay now control z control z control z and deleting this sphere editing a new sphere selecting that point and deselecting associative center point so the center point of sphere will not be associate any longer with the rectangles corner so if i am gonna edit this sketch and dragging this sketch down and finishing that the sphere will be remaining on its origin point okay i hope you understand and going ahead control z control z deleting this sphere another option is sphere and arc we have arc selecting that arc none or whatever whatever okay and the sphere will be created automatically so you don't have to define the center point of this sphere you got it okay now the second option cylinder I think cylinder have two geometry one is height and the another is diameter I don't know about third one okay there are two options axis diameter and height yeah you have to define the axis and uh, the second option is arc and height so I'm going to define the axis obviously the y-axis defining the point here also there are several points and there are several axes you already learned 
and uh, you can reverse the direction of uh, by pressing this button and uh, we are uh, i am suggesting uh, this use in front point selecting this point this point this point the center point of this arc anyway i am just selecting this point and the diameter of 180 and the height of 100 as it is no problem and uh, setting here also as uh, uh, associative exits just like the associative center so selecting ok then done I hope you understand ok if I'm gonna use this option double clicking and the reverse option and then done ok you can add this material to it so that's it uh, these all are uh, these all options are same as extrude so I'm not gonna learn you uh, teach you in this tutorial so another option will be axis uh, sorry arc and height so simply select the arc and uh, it will consider the diameter of arc automatically and the height will be 100 mm so okay there is no associative because the arc is itself associated okay this is the last option and uh, in the cylinder uh, this is deleting uh, the option in the cylinder where is the cylinder cylinder is here axis select i am selecting the axis this and uh, specify point this and associative axis okay now if i'm gonna decrease this extrude so automatically the cylinder will be decreased so that is the associative of axis okay guys thank you very much thank you for watching my video and keep practicing thank you enjoy designing